So I am walking around pregnant. And I'm on I'm pregnant and I had to chase you down. Thank you. Okay, so I am on the bus right now, you guys. And I am headed out of Texas. Um and I just want to keep y'all up to date about what's going on. I am with a child by Austin Meadow and I am leaving Texas. I've been carrying this child for two years. Um, and we are going to try to seek refuge. Okay, so it is hurting us to have to sit up straight like this for a 15 hour ride. It'd have been better if I could have stayed at somebody's house and somebody would have been able to come and get me um, because this is, you know, I'm glad to have someone to go, but I just don't feel right um, having to sit up straight like this, pregnant. It's hurting me, um, and it's no way for me to really get comfortable without my feet being all out in the aisle. So I just pray for my vindication. Um, from God for everybody that put us in this situation um, and thinking that it's funny, you know, to torture a child and a pregnant woman like that for a man that was abusing us. And I know it was uh, some satanic stuff going on as far as why he came doing that to us in the home, period. Um, because this government um, has pretty much given itself over to Satanism. Uh, regardless if that's what it was built upon or not, I'm not really <laughs> sure. It seems like that's pretty much what it was built on. But for him to come in my house attacking me repeatedly and the police refusing to help us, being tortured in the jail, and being tortured by Americans all over society, um, I see why God is saying that somebody needs to get me and my children out of America because this is ridiculous and it hurts. I ain't gonna go into too much detail about it, but um, a lot of people are getting off on the fact that uh, we that I've been in pain, um, and I want my vengeance, and I want my vengeance as soon as possible.